our second walk and it's only 9.30. It is day six. He is sleeping really well. He finally decided to sleep on the blankets on my floor. He's becoming a much more confident walker. But in general, he's becoming much more confident in his surroundings. He's very happy. Patrick, are you happy? He's happy. His wound is looking a lot better. A few days ago when we first got him, it was really puffy, almost like he had a tennis ball in there. But now the swelling has really gone down. It's a little puffy, but it's a lot better. You're healing. person I've ever met. I knew that this would be tiring, but oh my goodness, Patrick and I get up at 7 or 7.30 every single day. We go on probably 8 to 10 walks, multiple trips to the dog park. We don't take naps, he has no interest. I'm just down here in the parking lot at Casey Pet Project because Patrick's wound, I don't know if it's like a sunburn or if he has an allergy or it's just starting to bother him, but he's been licking it and itching it a ton. And a ton. It's starting to bother him. So they said, come back and get a cone. Honestly, today he's doing a lot better than he was yesterday. Because he's not really touched it at all today, we might not even try it, but just in case it gets bad again, we have it. He's not gonna like it. Every time you pee on a tree, it blows back at me. like belly rubs when you are outside. You don't let me do this inside, do you? This little man is pooped. We're almost home and he just plopped right down under this tree. I know he's thirsty. Oh, bud. Dude, we're only halfway through the walk. Come on, bud. I actually think this is the hottest day of the year. Patrick is stopping like every two seconds to just sit down. But he gets really scared when I walk with a water bottle. I don't really know what he wants from me. Hey Thirsty, we're literally two feet from home. I know you are so hot. I'm sweating. Please, can we go inside? Patrick, you're so proper. Sitting like a king. King of my heart. He keeps doing this thing where we will be walking and he will just stop. See what I mean? Oh, there he goes. Come on! And now we're just laying down and I can't get him to move. This is the fifth time he's just laid down, will not budge. He's literally just holding my arm in place so that we can't get up. Seriously? We are 
doing much better today, generally, except when we hear other dogs. Here we go. Now when he stops and pauses, I've just been standing in place, turning my back on him and not looking at him. And eventually he will just follow me. We're very hot. And I try to take water bottles with us so that he can drink when he sits down. But he gets really scared of the water bottles. It's happened again.